I'm going to take my mask off so you can see my face. Uh, I am Mr. Garcia Leva, please. Uh, um, I'm Mr. Garcia Leva. I am the new band director here at Northgate. Uh, some of you might remember me. I was the student teacher two years ago, the 2019-2020 school year. Um, so I am very excited to be back. Uh, we have an amazing community, amazing students, um, and amazing parents. And I'm just very grateful to, you know, have the opportunity to be back and working with our students. So right now, what we're going to do, we're just kind of setting up uh, for the music portion. But we're actually going to have the kids uh, show you, this is a showcase, right? So we're going to uh, show you what we've learned. And it's really amazing. I had no idea what I was getting myself into. Uh, you know, it's it's been a year and a half for most of these kids since they've been in the classroom, since they've played instruments with other people. Um, so, you know, I know skill level, some of us, we're practicing every day. Some of us haven't touched our instruments in a year. Uh, or more. <laughs> so, or more, right. So, um, you know, I, I know the big thing for me, my focus is making sure that we're transitioning uh, properly for students. I know it's really overwhelming for some of us to be back. It's, it's draining. I, I myself, I had a meeting at the district office and I can't remember the last time I sat there for seven hours just being talked to and I'm like, how are they gonna do it, right? For, you know, starting, starting in two days. Um, so I, my, my goal is just to make sure that these kids are having an amazing time, that they're adjusting well, that I'm doing everything that I can to support them uh, not only academically, but just in their growth as people. Um, we have a really, really amazing group of students. Um, and we've done some really, really amazing work. I think you guys are going to be impressed. I know I am. Um, so I'm going to ask you all to set your instruments down if you want to, like in the grass, if you don't want to put them on the concrete. Um, and then I'm going to ask all the parents if you'd like to go out to the blacktop because we're going to have them march over. Uh, we're going to do a little drill down and then we'll play some music for you. So bear with us as we all go over to the blacktop and uh, start our little event. Yeah. Go marching down. Bad! Attention! War! Attention! Rock goes rock! Now is what's called a drill dash. 
Yeah, the point game we played this week. Huh? Introduce yourself. Yes. Oh, my, my apologies. My name is Lear Ernesto the Mayor Iglesias. <laughs> they don't know me as the mayor. You know, I take charge. So, this game is called the Drill Down. It's a nice little fun, disciplined building activity. So, you know, hopefully they're making their beds a little better now. But, <laughs> It's a lot of fun. I think they really liked it. And it was for points throughout this week, which will all add up to a big prize that will be announced in a few minutes. So, I'm just gonna give a quick demonstration, and then we'll carry on with the music, which I'm sure you're all waiting for. Bam! Attention! One! Don't fall out. Right! Face! One! Two! Left! Face! One! Two! Right! Face! One! Two! by the numbers. Silent drill. Left face. Right face. About face. About face. Canceling silent drill. Hurry, press. You get the idea? Yeah. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of thought that goes into it. Helping them unify uh, in rhythm. It's helping them develop I think character, it's, it's very character building, um, it's helping them project their voice, uh, but really the main thing is unifying the band, right? Um, we all are coming from different backgrounds, a bunch of different uh, experiences in the past year and a half, um, so I think that this is a really, really amazing testament to how we can all come together um, and just begin unifying again. Kind of returning back to normalcy, but really, you know, it's, it's evolving, right? Normal isn't the same as it was before, uh, but that doesn't mean that there's anything wrong with it, right? We're evolving. Uh, there's a lot more beauty, I think, coming out of what we've experienced. So um, what we're gonna have them do, they're gonna fall out and if you wouldn't mind, we're going to head back over <laughs> and play some music for you. Um, so, Liam, go ahead and take, give them that command. One! When you receive the command to fall out, fall out, and report to the music station. Fall out! <laughs> All right, let's head over. Thank you so much. Uh, Soul Bossa Nova. This is uh, originally a jazz chart. We're gonna play for marching band, and we're gonna have some soloists. So after each solo, please uh, go ahead and show them some some love. Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay. So we have Matt, and then Aaron, and then Nate. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. Here's some solos. Yeah. <laughs> Starting at 11. There we go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one,
will eventually be memorizing that uh, and marching with that throughout their competition. Um, I mean, I, at, you know, I was completely blown away. I did not think we would be making this much progress. It's not an easy piece, um, but that just goes to show, you know. Uh, one thing that we really try to do during band camp is build community. Um, you know, we, we're having rehearsals through the, through the day, and then we have night events. Um, and those are really so that students can get to know each other, and so that they can um, just really grow, grow closer. And uh, typically, here at Northgate, traditionally, uh, the band director doesn't uh, direct the, the marching band. Uh, but I decided to take on take this on because I think it's really important, right, that we are establishing that we are reestablishing this community, so that way students feel comfortable. And I want to really take ownership of this program and make sure that we're really setting the tone for an, an, an excellent year, right? Yeah. Uh, so for our final selection. Uh, we are going to finish off with the Northgate Flight Song. This is, of course, you know, our Bronco Pride is going to show. And, you know, I hope that you guys are able to make it to our football game. We're going to be playing at those. Um, I don't think I really have much to say. I don't know if you'll see this. I hope not, but I'm really bad at... Uh, at finishing speeches, like I could just ramble on forever. So I'm just gonna stop talking and let them uh, play. So here we go, fight song. the winner of marching band camp. So I think we are going to crown our first, second, and third place. Um, and I'm gonna let Liam take care of that. So. Actually, this is the job of the spirit leader, Nathan oh. Cruz. Let's get it, Nathan. Nathan Cruz is our spirit leader. Um, marching band leadership, could you guys just give us a little wave? the 
band director, I got hired like mid June. So these kids have had it all planned before I even got here. They've done so much amazing work. Um, you know, a lot of it isn't even me, right? It, it's them. And I just really want to show appreciation. I want you guys to know that it, it's all them, right? Um, so Nathan is our spirit leader, and he's going to go ahead and present the awards for us. All right, Nathan. All right. This is a really cool trophy and a really nice trophy. Nathan. <laughs> there you go. All right, guys. What's up? My name's Nathan Chu. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is a really cool trophy, and this goes, uh, this is like, this points the entire week, where we added up the points at the end of the week. A little louder. To our... Mass off. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> if you guys couldn't hear me, then that was my fault. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to start awarding these trophies to the house of this week, but you guys probably don't know what that means. It was basically like the theme of our band camp for a whole week. We worked hard to get these trophies. So, you know, they deserve them. Um, so in third place, this really nice trophy goes to the Disney house. really um, we have really amazing and supportive faculty administration I would like to recognize Miss Kara Ravina who is our vice principal <laughs> but yeah we're so fortunate to have really amazing faculty staff administration here and we also have amazing parents and an amazing booster I would like to recognize our parent coordinator for marching band, really, I I just show up here and wave my hands in front of the kids. Everything that happens besides that, uh, I think Chrissy takes care of. So can we all recognize? Yeah. Yeah. So that that's pretty much it. I'm so excited. I hope you guys are too. And go such a huge, huge help, uh, particularly this week. I've been doing teacher orientations, all these other things, and they have really been, it, it's, it's amazing to be a teacher that can just trust their kids, say, you guys got it, right? And they just take care of business. That's, that's not something you find everywhere, uh, and that's something I'm really fortunate to have here at Northgate. Um, so let's recognize uh, Liam and Matt as well. Um, other than that, I just want to say I hope you folks are excited for the season. I hope to see you at our competitions. I hope to see you at our football games. 
and uh, it would be nice to have you, you know, be involved. We are, you know, always asking for parent volunteers. It doesn't have to be a huge commitment, but um, something small, uh, you know, many hands make a village. So I just want to say thank you. I don't know if our drum major has any final remarks, but um, but I'll hand it over to him to finish the, the evening. Go ahead. Well, this is the last thing, so I'm sure everybody's tired. I'm exhausted. It's been a long <laughs> week and a half, right. so I'm gonna try to make it short. But this last week and two days has been freaking great. I've enjoyed every single day with these amazing people, and I kind of, Miss Pelucci and I, we worked together from the very start and brought it together. But I could have not done any of it if it wasn't for my amazing leadership team. Leadership, can you guys just raise your hands, please? guys were awesome. On day one, I, I did not stress a single bit about the beginning of band camp. I told them the day before, guys, I will do nothing tomorrow. I'm just going to walk around and see progress being made. And they did an amazing job. Matt was amazing teaching drill. Aaron and Nathan were amazing teaching marching. And then Lil and Chloe, who's not here, they did great at teaching guard. It was awesome. I had a, a passing diss that was said at someone was that we learned more on the first day of band camp than we did all of last season. <laughs> and I think it's true. We made so much progress in this week. Today, we did our first time marching with instruments. And it was amazing. It blew me away. I don't think I've shown you the video. No. It's, it's great, guys. It blew me away first. I think that was our third time doing it. It was awesome. I loved it. These are a great group of guys. I'm so thankful to be able to work with them. Thank you all for your support. That's all I have to say. Yeah. Have a good